guys, what's going on? It is Amy again with Bargain Mama. And I'm trying to see, my phone has been having an issue lately of my voice not following my lips. And so I'm trying to watch, I just had to stop it because it wasn't. So please tell me in this video if um, my voice is going with my lips. It drives me crazy to watch somebody's video that is not. So please let me know. Anyways guys, if you watch my video from, I think I uploaded it yesterday, which was Saturday, you guys will see. I said I have a lot of stuff to finally haul. I did go at, to a couple places yesterday using my son's car, and um, don't don't hit mommy's camera. And um, so I have some stuff to haul finally. So let's get started. I did. So this is this first one is going to be from all yard selling yesterday. So I found this, and it's compliments of your local Chevy dealer, but it is a Washington Redskins um, blanket. And two reasons. One, if I keep this long enough, it will be very collectible because they are no longer called the Washington Redskins. They are called, um, I don't even remember, the Washington something. I don't even know. The name just doesn't make sense. But anyways, and the second reason is my brother-in-law, who is and has been forever a huge Washington Redskins fan, said he refuses to buy anything with their new name. And so I thought, well, maybe I'll just give him for this for Christmas or something. But I paid $2, so it was totally worth it. So it is just like one of these like crocheted type blankets. They're not crocheted, but whatever. So I got one for $2. What are they called now? I can't even remember. It's a silly name. Um, what else is in here? There's nothing in that box. Oh, okay. So I think I paid only a dollar for these. And I think these are the cutest little things. So my dog just literally came up. He's like 60 pounds and laid right on my feet. Like, and if you can see this little princess's face, huh? Yeah, this is our princess, huh? Yeah. Okay, yes, yes. Okay, he's not going to take your baby. Thud, no. Sorry. Anyways, I, these are handmade, but they were adult. Thud, don't take her baby. Um, but look at them. They're like wrapped around something. I don't know. Okay, yes. Yes, baby. Um. Okay, and it looks like they're from like the Batman movie. I don't know, they're little ninjas. Don't do that, baby. So here's this little guy, and they have the little hangers. Stop it, baby. Okay, lay down right here, come on. Um, and so then we have this little ninja guy. Okay. I just think they're so cute, and they're wrapped. I think they're like wrapped around balls or something. I don't know. And then we, don't try to eat them. And then we have this little blue guy, like a little ninja. And then I swear, this is why I thought it was from like Batman or something, because there's the Joker, and I swear that that's the Joker. And then we just have this little green alien goblin kind of guy. So I thought they were cute, and for a dollar, I picked them up. No, thank you. So there's those. I'm trying to see so that I don't show you guys too much clothes, or any clothes. One of these had to have been open, because it's spraying everywhere. Um, so this one is Velvet Petals by Victoria's Secret, and it's um, 8.4 fluid ounces bought these for me. I love spritzes more than like perfumes. So you can't really use perfumes usually when you're working in the medical field, but it really makes you feel kind of blah. Like, I don't know. So I usually just use sprays that are a little bit lighter mist. Um, so that I still feel like I put something on and these smell amazing and they're like full and I paid a dollar. And so this one is velvet petals. Oh, smells amazing. I paid a dollar for that. Oh, this is the one like I found it. Mm -hmm. Yep. Just dumped all over me. Um, this one is Moonlight Dahlia, and this is also eight point fluid ounces, and it's pretty much full. I got that for a dollar. Like I said, I'm not, I'm trying to not show the clothes, so I have to dig to the bottom here. Oh, I was so excited about this. I'll have to tell you in a minute. This little thing, hold on. Let me see if there's, okay, so that's all of those in there. Okay. I'm gonna put it right there. Okay. So. I had already like got everything packed up and they had already told me my total and over where they were, there was um, like this little thing of, I never really look at like the curling irons and stuff. A, I have my own curling irons and stuff. B, I don't really want to use something that was used in somebody else's hair. Um, and C, I don't know. I just don't, I don't know. But I found this and I really, I had one of these kind of like it a long time ago and it's got the hairbrush right here and then the curling iron kind of thing right here. My hair is very, very thick and very, very like textured and coarse. And if I do not brush my hair while it's wet, which is bad for your hair and I wait till it dries, 
OMG, it is so poofy, it is a hot mess and everything. Um, but I don't like to put a whole lot of heat on my hair. It's just a mess. Anyways, um, and I love my hair curl, just I don't know why. Anyways, so right as I was putting everything in there, I saw this and I didn't see what it was at first. I just saw like this part and I was like, oh my gosh, like I've what is that? Like I've been wanting one again, and it is an in styler. And it's brand new, except for they didn't have the box, guys. Um, yeah, and I got it for $1. And it's purple. How cute is that? And so last night I looked it up. They were like $99. I'm keeping this. I don't care because I really want to see how it works. So I actually, my hair is almost dry. You don't want it dry when you're doing this, I don't think. I don't know. But um, so I'm going to try this out later, and I'll show you guys probably on another video, just a really quick one. Um, but yeah, for $1, I got the InStyler, and it's like practically brand new. So I am so excited about that. That was probably my best find. Um, so I did pick this up for a dollar. This is the polyfill. And so if you guys watched, my, and it was a dollar, so that was a great deal. Um, my previous Dollar Tree hauls, I found the new pillows or pillow covers that Dollar Tree came out with for Christmas. And I was like, for, I, I could put it over one of my regular pillows, but for a dollar, I'll just fill those. So I got this package. How big are you? 12 ounces for a dollar. So I'm gonna fill my Dollar Tree pillow covers. Let me see, I think this one might almost all be clothes. Oh, this one. Oh wait, there's a couple things in here that are blankets that I wanna show you, but not clothes. So let's see, cause there's one I'm super excited about, this one. And then, I thought, hold on. Like I said, I don't really like showing you guys clothes because, I mean, you know, but. Oh, but I did get, I on Amazon, I ordered these two huge, um, what's that go to? Um, industrial racks for clothes. And I think between both of them, it was like $250. And they um, hold up to 600 pounds. So I'm truly hoping that that is going to help me better organize because again, I just started doing this in like July, August, something like that. And I have tried so many different ways. It's very stressful. I can't find the stuff I'm looking for. My garage is a disaster all over again. It's embarrassing. I don't even want to open the garage door. And so I truly think that these clothing racks, I mean, they, I put them together myself. I told my husband, go ahead and call me Amy, the tool woman Miller, because I put them all together. I was so proud of myself. Um, and so they really do look like the ones that like you carry your carts up to and from in a, um, like a hotel. So I'm super excited about trying those. I just did it today and then I had to go to work and stuff. So I'm going to put them together tonight. I'll send you, I'll show a picture on my community page, but, um, so I'm hoping that that will be more organized. So I did get that. And then I made my son push me on it so that I could make sure it was heavy enough. I'm, I range between 140 and 150 and he said, mom, if this doesn't hold you, you wasted your money. And I was like, I just want to see, I just want to ride on it. I tried to get the dogs. They were like, no way, no way. Anyways, I picked these up and these were a dollar each. I think this is amazing. And honestly, at first I just picked them up because I think they are cute and I wanted it. Um, but then I realized where they were from. I didn't see the Disney or anything. I just saw like the tie dye. I was like, oh my gosh, those are going to be so cute because I wear weird socks. But then I saw that it's Mickey and then I saw it's Disney and they're new on the package thing. And I paid a dollar for them. So I think I might just look them up. Thud, no. Sorry. Um, see how much like they... Robert, can you please go make sure that the dogs aren't trying to get over the wall? Um, so this is tie-dyed Mickey socks. I'll see. Um... But yeah, I just think they're cute. Um, I, do, I took the bag over here, but I forgot I was going to have to put stuff back in it. And then I found these. So let me just point out that these, they are very, like a thick, thick sock. I don't know really what the difference is. Oh, okay, because these are, so, well, they have men's first. So maybe these are more of a men's sock. Because these show men's shoe size first and ladies shoe size second. I hope you can see it down here. And this one shows ladies first and men second. So I think these are men's socks because they are way thick and heavy. And these are very thin, just like a regular sock. Um, and so these also say Disney and they're gray and they just have like little mini mouse with her little bows. Um, so yeah, I got those. They're still in the thing, so I think that's great. I did pick this up. I think I only paid $2 
Look at Belle, you like it? I love Christmas. I love everything about it. I don't like getting presents. I love giving them. I love family. I just love the smells. I love that it's not 100 degrees in Arizona. <laughs> so I picked this up. It's like, you know, the quilted, I mean, beautiful. So I picked that up for $2. No, no, don't take his baby, Belle, or the thud. Leave her baby alone. Um, there we go. So my prince, thud, no. So, <laughs> No, it's just Robert. Oh, she's thud, thud, give me back her baby. I'm so sorry. Thud, no. So, our prince, I know, hold on, hold on. So, I bought several of these at Easter time. So, this is our little princess that had the 10 babies on her first heat ever. Yes, we, you know, fixed her and stuff. But she is like the best mom. She took care of all of them. She was like, no, no, Robert, stop. She was only one when she had them. She was amazing. And so she just loves, don't mess around with them. She just loves being a mom, loves it. Um, and so she kind of misses it and she's always licking on their faces and doing stuff and they don't like it. So when these came out last year at the Dollar Tree, um, I bought her several of these and she carries it around. And I mean, obviously the guys, the boys fight her for it. So we're missing some arms and sometimes, you know, whatever. And sometimes it gets chewed up because you know, they take it from her. But, um, so she carries this around like her baby and she licks it and just carries it everywhere. So here, you want it back? There you go. See you later. And so the, her puppy always tries to take it from her. All right, let's see what this one is. This one I was super, super excited about. I mean, I'm sure I don't need to say it again, but my middle son is infatuated with Star Wars. I found this, it was only $2 and it's just like one of the blankets, but you put your arms in it and it's Star Wars and it is like, I mean, you can see it definitely looks like 3D. It is amazing, amazing. And I just think he's gonna love it. Like, I mean, the tag is still in good condition. So it's not like, you know, really yucky. And it's been like, obviously it's been like taken care of. And so I cannot wait to give this to him. So I got that for my middle son for $2. Yeah, that's a good deal. Um, I think that's it from this one. And I'm gonna let you guys go and then start another one. Um, but I just want to say thank you so much. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Um, and you guys have a great day. Bye guys.